Hello there, welcome back to my channel. My name is Mosley and today I have a new video for you. Um, so today I am going with this cloud-alike look. Um, and I, I know it's, it might not look as good on the camera, but in real life I think it looks a little bit better than camera because there's not as much uh, contraction in real life. Um, I'm not going to talk more about my makeup today. If you want to see um, like a mini tutorial on how I did this, please leave a comment down below. Um, and I'm going to drop right in for our mask review today. So today we are going to reviewing this Hello Kitty uh, Nutty Kitty Nutty Kitty face pack. So it looks like this. And this is the back of it. So um, the back of this... Um, the, this mask, I got it for $5 online, um, but luckily when I got it, it was buy one get one free, so I get it for a price of $2.50, uh, with not including the tax. Um, so if you really get it on a full price, it's kind of a, a pricier kind of mask in my opinion. Um, so I do have a high expectation to it compared to the other cheaper mask that I have used. Um, so this mask, um, it's most of it is in Japanese. It doesn't have any in English um, instruction, but um, apparently it is the mask inside of the mask. It should be looking like this, and there is a little line of word you can see. This line is supposed to tell you that you should be able to read this. Um, line of words so that's the side facing outward and the uh, character of this is it actually has a little piece cover your eyes instead of the usual facial mask that has a little hole you can just look through it look through it um, this one has a little piece as Hello Kitty's eyes um, so it covers the eyelid of yours so I have to say this is very very cool packaging I always wanted it I think they have other different kinds um, so like a different kind of face on it um, I only got this one I think um, it's just because it, it doesn't really tell you like is it hydrating or like it doesn't tell you like what specifically it does it just say is a face mask. Um, so on the back of it, it says has 20 milliliter of serum in it, and we shall see how much we actually get from the pack um, after the trying out for this. So on the instruction, the first part it says after washing your face, you should dry your face and put this on your um, clean face and put it neatly nightly. And you need to put the, like I said, the eye part on your eyelid. And uh, like I said, the writing of this is supposed to face outside instead of inside. And the third part is you put it on for 15 to 20 minutes and that should be good so um we shall see how hydrating it is it, if it's not as hydrating i might just keep it for less than 15 minutes but we shall see um so all in all i think this is a very cute packaging and i do think interesting is because this is it says it only sells in japan but it's made in korea so and here i'm going to insert um the clip of me trying out this mask Okay, so here is the part I'm gonna actually apply this mask. Um, and I'm gonna open it right now. It says, um, need to put on the face for 15 to 20 minutes. So I'm gonna um, put a timer real quick. Uh, since I think this is kind of dry, I'm going to put it for only 15 minutes. So here is the time, 15 minutes, and I'm going to hit start right now. Um, for this part, I'm going to um, put this covering my eyes, since I think that's how it's going to look. Um, right now, it looks kind of terrifying. Um, so I'm going to do that. You might be wondering why I take it off early. Um, I did take it off three minutes early, so I literally only leave it on for 12 minutes. So the reason that I take it off is because this mask is getting super duper dry on my face. Um, 
it is literally so dry at this area like when I take it off I don't know if you can tell like this part is not even wet it's like stuck on my face so I have to take it off right now uh, just in case they actually work on the opposite and make my face like more dry compared to before I using this mask um, before I toss this away I want to have a little bit of review on this demonstration um, so as you can tell there's the two sides of this mask and you can it should work you should wear it the way that I wear it because um, at the bottom there's this line this line is supposed to show outside so like everyone look at your face should be able to read this instead of like uh, not able to read it so I did put it on uh, right um, the side of this face mask is actually very wide it's wider than I thought it would be because um, most uh, Japanese facial mask I thought it would be a little bit smaller uh, this one is actually quite wide so I'm quite happy about it but on the other hand um, the serum in here is not the best the serum in here is actually um, not not serum alike so it's has this consistency between water and the serum so it's not as thick um, it's actually very very liquidy I pour it out it's like water I just put them on the mask or else it's be too dry um, so this is and this is um, kind of like a paper cloth paper cloth kind of material it's not one of those very very thin sheet it's actually um, little bit thicker compared to the papa recipe um honey bomb or honey kind of mess that i reviewed before um and i'm gonna do a little bit test on the squeezing test to see how much um serum i can get out of it as you can tell it's going really fast it's because the whole thing is very liquidy um so i still got this much I, I i can't this much of liquid i'm gonna put it on my face don't waste it, good stuff. So currently, I feel like my face, although it's slightly moisturized, is not super duper moisturized compared to um, the Peppa Recipe one that I have reviewed before. And this one, I think each one of this pack is five dollars. Um, I did got I did get it on a discount, so it was two dollars and fifty cents for each one. Um, but on the other hand, it, although this is already on this count, I don't think it's as good as the um, honey one um, that I reviewed before. If you haven't seen that video, please um, check it in my channel. Um, so yeah, but on the other hand, I think this is also very cute. It does look like the packaging. Um, it does look really cute on the face. Um, but if you don't put this part on, it's kind of terrifying to be honest. Um, in general, it's a very cute facial mask, but would I repurchase it? No, I don't think so. I don't think it worth $5 compared to other masks I have used in my life. Uh, if you're interested, I have other facial masks. I also have a Gudetama, um, the Lazy Egg facial mask. I haven't tried yet. Um, if you're interested in that, please leave a comment down below and I will review it later for you. Um, so, yeah. Um, I am just gonna do the ending in this face I so I can like get ready for other things so yeah this is end of this video if you like this video please leave a comment down below give me a thumbs up and stay tuned for the next one see you next time bye